kid like me had the opportunity to go to school, and I became bad. But there's kids that never had the opportunity to go to school because of being poor. It's not fair. My name is Toy Sabel. I am the founder of Tiny Tunes, Cambodia Youth Center, Break Dancing. My, my parents was a refugee in Cambodia. Uh, they ran to uh, the U.S. I grew up in Long Beach, California. I got to the U.S. when I was around two and started break dancing, tagging, and end up joining gangs and got convicted at the age 18 and was sent back to Cambodia. I started noticing when I first got here, a lot of kids don't go to school and I look at in the U.S. No matter how poor you are, there's a school system where you can go to school for free. And here, everything is goes about money, money, money. And that's what made it more of a challenge to just help push these kids back in. Tiny Tunes, we uh, teach English, Khmer, math, computer classes, and then we do break dancing, DJ, rapping, and graffiti and arts. From the beginning, it wasn't planned to do all this. It was just me trying to do something in Cambodia, move on with my life, and you know, trying to stay away from all the dramas I had. Most of the kids back in the days that used to be my student was either kids on drugs, kids that don't have home, uh, some are don't have no parents, some are infected with HIV, and I try to like keep everything in a little circle where there's no judgment. We have 28 staff here, and most of them are tiny tuned back in the days. Uh, they grew up, some went to college. After they graduate, they work here and help the next generation of tiny tunes. It makes me really happy to see them chase their dreams and their goal to become success in life, and then at the same time, support their family, help their brothers and sisters become something like them. Just want them to be one happy family and just, you know, hold hands and help each other make it.